everybody. It's Keith Gleason, host of Indie Comics Relay and creator of the Mighty Mascots. And I'm back with another serial review. <laughs> I forgot what I was doing there for a second. Um, I, you know, I, I tend to do serial reviews, but just on unique, uh, different serials, you know, like there's like Frosted Flakes and everything else in the, the store. But I only, you know, try to do something unique when I see one. So the cereal we'll be uh, taking a look at today is Peep Cereal, which uh, looks interesting. Um, before we get into that, I would like to just um, remind you guys that the uh, Alterna Winter Campaign is still going on. It's in demand. Uh, I believe the printed comic, the comics are just about done printing, and this should be fulfilling uh, very shortly, um, uh, I saw some um, saw some tweets from Pete about it. Um, and as soon as these books arrive, this will be going right out to um, fans. And then also, it'll probably be the campaign will be closing shortly after that. Um, that's what he usually does. And the, also, the spring campaign is going on right now too. So this is the only the only way you can get the. The alternate trading cards are only available if you get them through the campaign. Um, it's a great way to support us. And um, if you haven't gotten Mighty Mascots 5 and 6, they are both in this campaign. So check that out. Um, and, uh, you know, follow us. You follow all the creators. Uh, you know, you know, check everything out that we're doing. It's an exciting time for our indie comics brand and for Alterna Comics. All right, uh, let's get back to this review. So we're looking at, so let me show it again, Peep Serial. Um, so uh, everybody knows kind of peeps have been around forever, you know, ever since I can remember. I used to get those all the time with my Easter baskets. Um, so, yeah, we'll see how this cereal is. I uh, should be interesting, but I poured a bowl out already. Let me see if I could tilt that so you guys can see what it looks like here. It looks a little bit like Fruit Loops or Tricks or something. It has a lot of um, a lot of marshmallows in it, and but it has the rings that are very similar to um, Fruit Loops and things like that. So I'm curious what this is going to taste like. Um, so I got our little milk here in my uh, sweet Alterna mug. <laughs> so let me uh, pour some milk in here and we will try this bad boy out. All right. All right. Swish it up a little bit here. All right. <laughs> All right. So moment of truth. Let's go. Hmm. It's not bad. It's um, it taste. You know, I thought I was gonna have a fruit taste to it because it looked like uh, fruit root, fruit loops, just from the initial um, you know, just looking at the, the cereal itself. But it actually tastes very like a marshmallow flavor. Let me see what the box says here. Oh yeah, marshmallow flavored cereal. So there you go. So the other uh, yeah, so it tastes. It has a marshmallow taste, which is kind of interesting. Didn't think they could get that with like a crunchy cereal. Um, there is a lot of uh, marshmallows in it. Uh, one thing I noticed right away too is the consistency of the marshmallows. Uh, usually in a cereal, they're usually hard. You know, the milk tends to soften them a little bit, um, but these like these kind of melt in your mouth, like really soft. Like, um, and I don't know if that's because the cereal is so fresh, but. I don't remember ever having a cereal with like that soft consistency to it. So that's really nice. Um, yeah, I liked it. It's not bad. I don't know if I would buy this all the time, but, um, you know, I, I, I liked it. So yeah, give it a thumbs up. Um, and then, uh, the other thing I always like to look at is like the box and how much, um, you know, how much time and care they take into making a presentation. So this is from Kellogg's. I, I like the front of it. You know, they get the big peep. You know, right there in the center there, big peeps. Um, oh, and they already advertised 50% more marshmallows, so that's kind of fun. Uh, limited edition, so that's probably only out for Easter, I would imagine. Um, taking a look at here at the shapes. So it looks like the marshmallows are in the shapes of peeps and, like, rabbits. So actually, the shapes of all their actual Halloween candy. Um, looking at the calories, it looks to be pretty standard for cereal. 
about 150 a cup or it looks like one and a, one third cup so actually it's a little better than most cereals hmm i wonder if that's because they have more marshmallows in it i don't know but um you know uh the ingredients look to be about the same i like the back though too check this out um so they made a little game for kids to play here it looks um very much like candy land which is kind of fun so you have to start at the beginning here and get your peeps to the the easter basket at the end of it um i looked at the 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 rules a little bit and it's i guess what you do is you um you reach into the box and whatever you pull out you call is that you you can jump to the color that you have in your hand so it's kind of sounds kind of fun you know i don't know if kids would even bother with that anymore but um you know anything that's kind of fun um you know sides there looks like it's all just showing the cereal and then there's really nothing on the bottom either there's an answer key because it looks like there's a there's a another thing here where you can um you have to count how many uh you know, cheap uh, peeps and um, rabbits are on the cover or something like that. So, um, so a couple little games, you know, um, definitely better than some boxes I've seen where it's unlimited cereals where they just <laughs> you throw it together and just get it out there. But that's kind of fun. They little, actually look, took a little time to make a little game there. So thumbs up on the box design. Um, one of the things I wanted to mention too is, um, uh, <laughs> I like, I like peeps and it's a good treat. You know, um, me and my wife will buy some, you know, once in a blue moon, you know, when they're out, um, the, the I, I highly recommend the party cake one. It tastes really good for some reason. Um, and I, I, you know, I've run into this thing where I've noticed some people like them stale. So if that's you, let me know in the comments. <laughs> I, uh, I'm not a fan of the stale ones. I've, I've had them before. But I, I, you know, I understand there's some things I like stale, like cheese puffs and stuff. So I get that. And one thing I was going to say is like I, the Peeps brand is kind of out of control a little bit. So <laughs> I, and what I mean by that is um, it used to just be that you got them once a year at Easter. But now it seems like, you know, there's Fourth of July Peeps or Autumn Day, you know, <laughs> it's like uh, Arbor Day Peeps, you know, they're out for every holiday. And um I was in CVS the other day and, and, you know, you know, of course everything Easter is out now. So, but I saw that they had peeps like bath bombs. You know, it's like, uh, you know, I, I think if you're going to take a bath, I think the last thing you want is like a peep bath bomb. I mean, I don't know, maybe it's awesome, <laughs> but I was like, uh, this is a classic case of stay in your lane, peeps, you know, but I don't know. It could be good. Whatever. You know, <laughs> hey, you know, uh, if if it makes some money, more power to them, you know, so. But all right. Well, everybody, thanks for tuning in for this uh, this cereal review. I, I like doing these from time to time whenever we find a, a unique cereal or something like that. So. It's always good to do them and do them in like a timely, you know, timely way. So there you go. Um, uh, just a quick reminder, check out the, the alternate campaign that I showed at the beginning of this video. Also tune in to our live streams that are usually every other Wednesday night at 9 p.m. Eastern. Like, subscribe, subscribe and uh, share the video if you like it. Um, join the channel. Uh, help us grow. We're, we're just trying to get, you know up to a thousand subs and then beyond, you know, so try to get some of that, uh, you know, incentive, you know, that uh, monetize monetization that everyone's talking about, you know, um, so definitely help us get it, get there. So, all right, everybody, thank you very much. Uh, have a great week and um, have some great breakfast cereal. All right. We will talk to you this Wednesday on the live stream. All right. Bye everybody. See ya. I'm Hey, kid! Yeah? Are you looking for something exciting to read while you enjoy some sugary cereal? Yeah! Then grab a copy of Mighty Mascots from Alterna Comics! Born from the ashes of a disastrous 3D printing accident, eight living advertisements have banded together to right the wrongs of this world. Led by a former child star, these unlikely heroes are freaks to some, but you will know them as 
The Mighty Mascots. The miniseries is three issues full color and printed on glorious newsprint. This is the fun superhero series that you didn't know you needed. Created and written by Keith Gleason, featuring artwork by Ian Morianto and colors by Anton Bondi. Ahoy, I can't wait for more! Mighty Mascots is part of your complete breakfast and comic book reading experience. Only from Alterna Comics. <laughs>